M0 FXB just here at home, just connected my hotspot, MMDVM. Just the usual sort of jumbo hotspot here. And we've just got an adapter that takes me to my HDMI cable here. So it's the HDMI out from the hotspot there to a normal HDMI. Then I've got the cable running basically to the side of the telly. Then I've also got an just an adapter here which takes me from micro USB in the middle one, so the next one in, micro USB, to USB here, and then I can plug in my keyboard, I can type in commands. So there you are, just on the monitor there. Well, the reason I'm doing this is I'm trying to get the dashboard to show up on an external screen, which I've got some script to do this, I'm just going through it. I found the script here on K2GC, and I've gone through... And I'm basically running commands. I've got I've logged into PyStar. All you do is go to your PyStar configuration, like so. Once it shows, go to expert. Then you can SSH in this way. I could do it on my you know on my uh, big telly. And the, and the login is PyStar with a dash and that with a flat line in the middle, and then Raspberry for password. So once you get to that point, then just follow these. Look, number one, the SD expand the SD card, sudo pi star expand. Then you have to sort of reboot it. Then typing RPI dash RW, I think that means it makes it writable. Then you add this one and just follow it down. This is what I did. When it got to the install GUI, it was a very long install. And I've got to the end of that which is fine, but there is one last section that I've um, had a problem with, which is at this point you need to use SSH either direct or through the dashboard. The next few steps will make sure you don't have to log in. So I tried logging using a keyboard, but I log in, but it doesn't actually show the dashboard. And then you'll have to edit the following using the editor of choice, Nano VI ETC. You must use sudo with your editor to have proper permissions for editing the file. So I can't seem to uh, find the line that contains location admin, create a new file. And I can't, I'm still not, you know, I can do that, but I'm still, it's still not booting up um, with the dashboard. 7.3 for now. 